start with the name of Allah, the most merciful and almighty, my respected teacher, my dear classmates, Assalamu alaikum. Hopefully you will be great, active and having a good afternoon. As we know today our topic is about that, why do you think that should we send Afghani to their home country or not? So this is too much interesting topic and um, I will explain my own ideas on it because everyone in the whole universe have different ideas and different thinking. So we will probably talk about that why we should send Afghani to their home countries. Is it important for our country or not? So I will say that I would like to say that we do not need to send them to their home countries. Because there are lots of reasons. I'm also going to explain that why we don't need to send them. As we know, this is the word. In the whole world, if you look at so we will face thousands, millions of people that are migrating from one place to another place. As how we look at to our home country's people, for example, thousands and uh, like thousands and millions of Pakistanis are living in UAE, as we know that. They are living in UAE and they are running their own businesses. UAE just give a place to them because their country wants them that they should come here to a home country, to UAE start their businesses here and that will really rapidly increase their economy and in the whole universe will run about this so if, if you think that that we should keep out a bunny from our pakistan so they will not run their businesses they will not run uh, their um, they will not run their homes so you are thinking wrong because afghani is that kind of uh, simply we can say people that they live in the whole universe there are 220 countries and most of the famous are european countries and uh, which is more than 60 countries european countries so if you look at every country so you will pay sabhanis especially the top countries in the world if you talk about london if you talk about us if you talk about germany if you talk about france italy greece yunnan if you talk about Finland, Netherlands, Iceland, Norway, Denmark, in the whole universe you will face Afghanis. Because as we say, as we have seen that before this, there was a war going be between US Army and the Afghanis. So because of that, lots of Afghanis migrate to the other countries. And especially more than Pakistan, Afghanis are living in Turkey. As you know. Turkey. Turkey. So you will, you will see lots of Afghanis here in Turkey. So this is not the good idea of us. Yes, we believe that our government wants that. But if we look at about our own ideas, so if you think that there are enemies, etc., etc., so you are thinking wrong. Because in Islam, we learn that every Muslim is the brother of another Muslim. We believe on that. The whole Muslim of the world are brother with each other. If today you think that we keep out of uh, them to, from our home country, so we will start our own businesses. Where were you when they came here and started their businesses? Where were the Pakistanis when the Afghanis came here and started their businesses? This is not the only the benefit of them. This is the benefit of you also. Because the first thing, your economy is running on them. As we know that because of the war, the country goes down. Because of the corona, we look at the China about the last condition in 2021 the china was going to be the toppest country in the world in 2023 they announced that but when they pass corona that gets down as same like as pakistan it's, it's already in a, in a bad condition and it will be worse more and more if you have any kind of question us so kind of i would like to say that they start their businesses in pakistan why not you? Because you do not have money. Have I have a question. So you why get an opportunity to work person, a job with them. Why they bring clothes and other things to Pakistan by illegally? He said why they import clothes illegally? From where they import clothes? Yes. Look at from China and from other countries. Yes. So if they uh, import it legally, so what will happen? So it will be benefit for Pakistan. How? They will pay tax on it. Yeah. If you sell anything in your home country, where the money is going? Where the money? Where is going? What? Where the money is going? In the state bank of, to the state bank of Pakistan? Your pocket. No, not to my pocket. Why not? If you don't submit uh, uh, taxes, 
So how who says that the people are keeping money in their home? What you will do on money? If I, for example, I'm working in a factory, I, I earn 1,000, what I will do? I will buy something for myself, is that correct? Yes. Yes. From whom I bought, what he will do? He will buy something on it, surely. So the taxes are going to the pocket of the country of Pakistan, the state bank of Pakistan. If they import it illegally, but when they sell it, where the money is going? The taxes are, they are paying the taxes when they are buying things from Pakistan. They are not importing clothes from Pakistan. So how you say that they are not paying taxes? If they, once they import the clothes, when they sell it, where the money is going? They will buy something for themselves. They are not sending money to home country Afghanistan. This is the answer. And hopefully that will be clear. 